Kelly. When they heard his beat. Okay, my name is Joshua Alabi. Um, I studied theatre arts. Uh, I'm a producer, a TV stage producer and director. I write sometimes, make money from writing. And then I'm an actor. And basically, I'm a performer anyway, and I'm the director and founder of Kenyans of Concepts Productions. It's a young people's theatre company, and our core is to reju rejuvenate theatre and to help young talents to explore themselves. In that. Uh, Google Justice is a play written by Femi Branch, the Nollywood actor. So what I did was I just spoke to him, told him, because when we started at the Ethnic Heritage Centre last year, we started something called the Theatre Tori Series. So it was about, for us as young people, we want to do away with the classics, fantastic plays, we want to do away with all the old plays, Shoyinka, or Shofison, or La Routine. We want to introduce and um, explore new plays, new, by new playwrights, by the younger generation, importantly. So I thought about it. Femi Branch is still a young person. He has a very fantastic play, which we think we can really interpret. So why not? So we produce other plays by young people, other young people. One thing about good plays is always like, it's like, it's written a quote or a prophecy by a prophet. So he wrote it some years ago before many of these issues, a high class caught some things began, began to, I mean, pop up in Nigeria. Um, basically, it's about the class system, it's about the injustice, it's about the questions and stampedes the legal system in Nigeria. So I think for me, everything inspires you as far as Nigeria is concerned. Things are not well, things are not okay, things are the way they are. And we as young people, how do we put in our quota? How do we speak? How do we um, advocate for change? So it's by doing something that is social political. Justice approached it through the layman's point of view, not layman's point of view, but uh, through the grassroots point of view. In Nigeria, it's always known to be the rich man has a cut thing and then he builds his way out or a cut issue and then he finds his way out with whatever means. But now the playwright has tackled it through um, someone who's rooted, uh, the, a grassroots person, saying that regardless whether you are rich, very rich or very poor, the legal system in Nigeria is about what you can offer. So far you can offer something, you can have your own. Kelly, when they hear this beat, they're dead.